cars. Open the doors! Arkham! Listen to me! Freedom is yours! The only one standing in your way is Batman. Batman. He stuck me in here! Me too. Let me out. He's the crazy one! inmates loose. The leader of the children of Arkham. Did you see her? They went... Pleasure to see your work in person. Jesus. Gordon's here. We'll round up the rest of the inmates. You stop Lady Arkham. Thomas Wayne condemned to this place unwillingly. 
They speak through the walls. Their ghosts walk. They know the way. I can't help those people now, but I can help Alfred Pennyworth. Take me to him. My pleasure. You've already lost, Vicky. Come out and surrender! <laughs> Let him go! The butler has to die. Payment for Thomas Wilson's sins. He took away my family, so I'll take away his sons. If you really want to save the butler, bring me Bruce Wayne. If anyone can find him, it's you. He's probably cowering behind a 12-inch thick wall and a hundred bodyguards right now. Why should I trust you'll keep your word? Because my mask is off now, Batman. I won't lie. You're doing so much for one old man. Falconian Hill got what they deserved. <laughs> That's quite the turnabout, Batman. I don't think I believe you. You shouldn't be here. You shouldn't be defending him. You think Bruce Wayne is any better than his father? He hides behind his status and wealth. He's a coward. Blaming other... was always meant to be. What about you? Do you wear the mask to hide? Or to become who you really are? Are you the man? Or the mask? The mask is just a tool. I could never do my job if people knew who I really was. Really? Well, I was hoping for something a little more interesting. And once you're dead, I'm going to mount that mask on my wall. But first, I'll see the man beneath. you said. I knew you'd come. The man, the man I, I made you. Just hold on, Alfred. Did you see where she went? Uh, she just 
Dis disappeared. I'm getting you out of here. Above you! <laughs> Interesting how you speak to him. So familiar. Alfred. <sighs> Such concern. For someone you've never met before. Concern I don't have for you. Huh. Sounds like deflection to me. There's more here than you're telling. It makes me wonder. Do you really care? Only one way to find out. Oh. Batman! Don't you- Shut up, old man! You've seen my true self. Your turn. Prove that you can. Take off your mask. Let me see the man you really are. You're only a piece in the bigger game, but you're the only piece I have left.
to last week's events at Arkham Asylum. A spokesperson for the GCPD assured us that the breakout has been contained and all inmates have been returned to their cells. Miss Vale is missing and presumed dead following a gruesome battle with the caped vigilante known only as the Batman. Her death marks the end of Children of Arkham's reign of terror. <sighs> if the public knew the half of it... It's better that they don't. Uh, this came in the mail. It's unsigned. Selena. Alfred, here, L let me help. No, no, don't. With everything that's been going on, I... I, uh, I haven't yet thanked you, Bruce. You saved my life. I've no doubt Miss Vale would have killed me had you not arrived when you did. But the fact remains, in my state, I'm not of much use to you. It'll take time to adjust, and I'm afraid it may interfere with my butler duties. Without you, none of this would work. You are my family. You don't know how good it is to hear you say that, after everything that's happened. I promise you, I will use everything at my disposal to help you. Oh. Well, sure. I mean, the silver's not going to polish itself, is it? <laughs> we will get through this, Bruce. Don't lose sight of the fact that you've done some real good for Gotham. You should be proud. I didn't take them down alone. I had help. You, Lucius, Gordon, Selina, and all those who gave their life fighting for Gotham. To those who helped, and those we lost. The damage done by the children of Arkham has left Gotham a city in turmoil. Faith in those at the top has perhaps irrevocably been shaken. Acting Commissioner James Gordon has promised to speak out about the issue tonight during an emergency citywide address. And I hope, despite the recent terror that's gripped our city, that Gotham's leading citizens will come out to show their support. Will his token appointment be enough to regain the city's trust? It remains to be seen, but experts agree that Gordon requested Gotham's leaders to stand behind him. Leaders like you. Let Gotham see who Bruce Wayne truly is, and let them know what you plan to do for his future. Well, this could be a first start. For you, and for this city. Though, in Gotham, the only figure that can make as much impact as a Wayne... ...is Batman. You've helped this city tremendously, both as Bruce Wayne and Batman. And that person, whether he dons a cape or not, is someone I'm proud of and honored to call my friend. I'm just doing my job, nothing more. You're a better man than you'll admit. So, what do you intend to do about tonight? Well, Lucius has yet to invent a suit that'll let Bruce Wayne and Batman be in the same place at once. That is unfortunate. I suppose you must decide whose appearance will be more valuable. As Bruce, you can help repair the damage done to your name get the public support so that you can change things from the top down. But Batman is a symbol of justice and strength. Maybe in these dark times that is truly what Gotham needs the most. Perhaps one is truly the mask, and one is who you truly believe you are. <laughs> <laughs>